Hey, what's up, band kids? Young and olds, I'm Russ, also known as RK Slave, for Marching Band is Awesome, and this is the last of the top 12 quick fire videos, which are turning out not to be too quick, but I'm glad because I'm... I got morning beard. Hey, so these are unedited, but I'm glad that they're turning out to be, you know, eight, nine, ten minutes instead of three or four minutes because we can actually talk about um, these uh, a little bit more details about all of the places in in um, specific video burst instead of trying to cram everything into a top 12 video and having to leave out details and stuff. So um, if you if you don't know what I'm talking about, you will look at the videos that I uploaded today. I, I'm uploading a handful of videos instead of just one massive video, and I'm not doing any editing on them. I don't have a whole lot of time this weekend. You can see behind me, I am in the middle of pack, uh, unpacking our life. We just moved all the way from California to Georgia, and um, you can see this. I won't spend any time. I won't even play it, but my P-Trumpet, it's one of my favorite things to goof off with. Um, I had that in storage for a whole year. I had no trumpets, no horns to play when I was out in California, so uh, my chops are mush, and I'm ready to play. So um, maybe I'll do a video a little bit later, maybe in the week or so, and I'll see if I got any chops left. But um, so so this particular video is going to be about the, um, I've already covered one through seven, Places. And so this video is going to be about the 8th, 9th, 10th, and 11th spot. Um, and I've already done a video about the Madison Scouts grabbing that 12th spot. So this video is 8 through 11. And so we'll talk about the core there and those placements from the semifinals. And so let's go ahead. Let's jump in. We've got the Blue Knights. Let me pull up the score. I'll just run through the scores real quick. We Blue Knights in eighth place with a 91.013. Phantom Regiment with an 89.887 in ninth. Blue Stars in tenth place with an 88.975. And the Crossmen in eleventh place with an 88.488. Which, uh, if you know the finals, uh, line, uh, the semifinals. Why can't I talk today? If you know the semifinals scoring from last night, you know that the Madison Scouts secured that um, 12th spot and jumped in the finals um, after not making it last year. So that was pretty sweet to see them back in. Also a big shout out to the Mandarins who had a historically high um, placing semifinals this year too. So they didn't make the finals, but they uh, scored higher. I think four places higher than they had scored in previous attempts. So that's pretty sweet. But anyways, let's get back to it. The Blue Knights um, with that 91.013 scored. Let's take a look at the calculator and get the exact score here. So 91.013 minus Phantom's 89.888 is 1.125. So the Blue Knights... Um, and Phantom Regiment have kind of been going at it all season for that eighth spot, um, kind of that seventh, eighth, ninth spot. It's just been in flux a little bit. So the Blue Knights, strong performance. Um, 1.125 separates eighth and ninth. Um, and so according to DCI.org, that advantage uh, really is in the music category and the captions. And if we look over here uh, at the recap, we see that Blue Knights was eighth in total GE total visual and total music and then um, let's see seventh and brass and music analysis and tenth and color guard and then phantom regiment was eighth in brass ninth in percussion eleventh in visual proficiency in music analysis and ninth in everything else so if you kind of go across and look at the blue knights let me highlight this I'm over here now on the caption um, recap, which you can get to by going to dci.org, click on the scores link at the top, select the event that you want to, and then when that event comes up, you'll see on the top right hand corner, um, you'll see a view recap button and you can come to these charts. I've had several people on live chats and in comments ask me how does Drum Corps International do their scoring. And so many times we'll have band kids that like to watch DCI because it sounds great and it looks great, but they don't understand the scoring and so or, or even just casual fans of music um, and so a great way to understand it is to actually go look at it and and 
you'll see those categories. And so I also want to point out that, I think I mentioned this earlier, but these videos are going to be unedited, blah, 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 unedited. Uh, and so you'll get a lot of that. You'll get a lot of me stuttering through my words with a lot of and, ands and, uh, and uh, I typically edit those out when I'm reading from a script and it just takes a long time to do that. And there's so much going on Thursday night, Friday night, Saturday night. I mean, just stuff is going, it's moving too fast. And so I just need to do these edits. I mean, these unedited videos. So please bear with me, bear with my lifestyle behind me. I don't live like this all the time, but we just moved in and just about all of the other rooms of our house are unpacked. And I just haven't gotten to, these are like books. I mean, you can see I've got some books and music stuff and uh, this is my office area so it's a lot of office -y type stuff but anyways let's talk about uh, the captions uh, between that eighth and ninth spot like i said before uh, really close in ge 36.25 blue knights uh, 36.05 so two tenths of two tenths of a point there phantom regiment um, pretty close in visual and then also uh, very very close well not quite as close in in music but still close enough to keep the overall score what did I say um, just barely over a point difference there so um, Phantom and Red Phantom Regiment is going to have to um, come on a little bit stronger in several of those caption categories to overtake the Blue Knights to grab that eighth spot and um, if we look at the eighth spot to the seventh spot um, it's actually pretty close there. Um, the seventh spot, I talk about in another video, but if the cadets are gonna hang on to the seventh spot and not give it up to the Blue Knights, we've got about seven tenths, looks like, of a point there. So that's a possible upheaval there. We could see the Blue Knights actually overtake the cadets if something uh, shakes up there. But let's move on down to the um, number 10 and 11 spots. And so we've got um, DCI basically says that this is arguably the two most competitive cores this season, um, which I've seen. You know, we've done these recaps and we talk about that uh, 10 and 11 spot a lot, you know, because I typically do uh, top six, top 10, and then top 12. And so fighting for that top 10 spot is always uh, something that I talk about when I've done these recap videos. And so the Blue Stars and the Crossmen have been right there fighting for that spot. Um, Blue Stars grabbed the 10th spot with an 89.9, excuse me, 88.975. Let's go ahead and punch that in, 88.975, minus the Crossman in 11th with an 88.488. So less than half a point, that's .487, 487 thousandths of a point separate the 10th and 11th spot. And so um, that's actually up from last night's, uh, excuse me, from Thursday night's um, difference there. And so, um, but they've been duking it out all season. And so, um, so this at DCI.org says, entering Saturday's finals, the two have yet to be separated by more than a point in 14 head-to-head -head meetings of which, the, which, of which the Wisconsin core has won nine, um, which is pretty cool. So it's been really, really close. So out of 14, uh, the Blue Stars have won nine and the Crossmen have won five. <laughs> Math, yay. Um, which is pretty sweet. Let's take a look at the recap roundup here. Um, so Blue Stars with their 10th place got seventh in color guard between 9th and 11th in all other captions. Um, Crossmen, 9th in music analysis and 10th or 11th in everything else. So. Um, I don't want this video to be super, super long, but we have a great battle. Uh, I would also throw in the Madison Scouts there sitting in that 12th spot. Um, if we look at their scores from last night, um, there is a big gap between number 12 and 11, between Madison Scouts and Crossman. But if for some reason the Madison Scouts just get on fire, you know, will we see them going into that uh, number 11 spot? Um, but definitely we've got, I mean, it, it is on fire. It is a heated battle for the 10th spot between the Crossmen at 11 and the Blue Stars at 10. Uh, and like I said, the point difference last night was 0.487, but the point difference in the um, 
Thursday night competition was only point, what was it? It's either point one five or point zero one five. Yeah, point one five. So um, just over one tenth of a point difference there. So um, it's exciting. It's exciting. So we're going to have a great finals performance, not just to see who wins and gets that top one, two, or three spot, but to see who who fills out the top six and the top 12 and how all the dust settles and where they fall. And if you love music and performance and you just want to see great shows, this has been a great season for that. And so um, who do you think? Uh, is it going to be Blue Stars or Crossman? Who's going to, who's going to win that battle? And... Um, can Madison, can the whoa, can the Madison Scouts jump up into into the top eleven or even top ten? Yeah, well, you know, will we see that big of a shakeup? And so, let me know in the comments. I love your comments. If you love DCI and marching band videos, hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, it's a little bit long, but we can kind of cover a whole lot more details when I um, don't cover all twelve of or all twenty five of the top core. Um, but anyways, if you love this type of video and you love this video smash that like button and um, hit me up in the comments let's talk about it and as always I'm Russ also known as RK Slade because I'm an author and I write marching band time travel adventure awesome stuff um, also known as RK Slade there it is if you ever wondered why I'm RK Slade but um, for marching band is awesome Remember, Marching Band is awesome because you're awesome, and I'll see you in the next video.